So Justin, we're here at uh, Furnaces North America. Traffic looks like it's been great. And you know, we really appreciate uh, Radine and, and your company's uh, sponsorships and just y'all's support of the Metal Trading Institute, your expertise for all of our members worldwide. Um, but what I want to talk about here today with you is a lot of traffic, people coming by, captive commercial heat treaters. What are some of the challenges and the uh, struggles they're really here that you're hearing, they're here really to solve, to try and have um, answers to? Yeah, well, we, we're seeing the, from people that, that they really have a challenge with, with uh, the size of their equipment today. Mm -hmm. So we've been uh, able to introduce some new products that are really changing the, uh, the kilowatt uh, volume relationship that customers see. Right. Uh, this is a big deal sure. uh, for us because, because uh, it makes us much more attractive than, than, and, and it conserves uh, floor space for our customers. Right, right. One of the other major challenges they have is they have difficulty attracting people that are experts in induction for their uh, for their shop floor. So what we've been doing is is to simplify the easy, and make our products as easy to use as possible. Right. Uh, one of the major features that uh, people have been really excited about at the show is that we have a calculation system in our power supply mm. that tells you how to adjust the system to get full power. Right. Well, in the past, no other no other uh, power supplies really had this feature, and so the people were, were left to to go and find physicists and engineers right, to right. be able to calculate these things out for them, or a trial and error approach that didn't really uh, always result in the right uh, answer, and it took a very long time for people to get to the right answer. Right. Well, now, you know, in a lot of industries, we're in the largest technology shift we've ever experienced in our history of mankind. Um, in the world of furnace induction, the things that you work with, is that technology shift as fast, and, and what kind of shifts are you seeing? Well, we're having a, a tremendous uh, technology shift. Uh, we're integrating uh, advanced digital signal processing technologies, very, very high-speed data acquisition systems, uh, real-time parallel processing uh, uh, on a chip mm -hmm. at the same time. Mm -hmm. These technologies are all uh, 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 coming together um, uh, to provide us with the ability to regulate and control these systems at speeds that's, that's orders of magnitude better than, than the current generation of product on the market. What does that mean for our customers? More reliable systems, systems that don't trip, right. no nuisance hassles to be uh, to, to occurring with the systems. Right. Plus at the same time, we're able to monitor uh, water temperature coming in, water nice. temperature going out, humidity inside the unit, um, the water temperature coming back from the inductor. Mm -hmm. uh, we were able to monitor voltage, current, DC current, line current. We were able to really provide a tremendous amount of diagnostics and, and to be able to trend these, uh, these, this data to see right. if there's a maintenance uh, that should be scheduled coming sure. up. Well, now, I know your company's big in R&D. Y'all are coming out with some really cool stuff. So you, we, we've talked about the challenges and the struggles they're, they're, they got on their minds, they're trying to solve. We've talked about the technology shift. So connect those dots with specifically what your company is doing that is so exciting, uh, things that you're at liberty to talk. I know a lot of people say, well, our R&D is in the back room and it's a mystery, we can't. But what are you at liberty to say that's exciting about what your company's doing with product to solve those things? Well, again, uh, we're, we're focused on, on, on finding the best talent uh, coming out of the universities today, number mm -hmm. one. Um, we've built a, a fabulous R&D team. Mm -hmm. And that R&D team's mission is to, is to basically replace what a heat treater's concept of induction heating is today mm -hmm. with, a, with something that's totally alien and very simple to use, okay? So we're going to revolutionize this industry. We're going to bring, the, we're bringing the latest technology to it. And uh, you're going to see some amazing products, and you already see them here, uh, that, are, that are networked, yep. intelligent, uh, predict when there's going to be an issue, maximize uptime for the customer, conserve floor space for the customer, provide absolute accuracy and repeatability for part to part, right. and detect when there's problems uh, right. with parts. Well, nice. Well, you know, um, MTI, 79-year-old organization, um, got some great sponsors, and you're one of those, and we really appreciate Radine's commitment to the Metal Treating Institute, the uh, success of the commercial heat treater now growing captive market, and we appreciate you for being here at Furnaces North America. And, and thank you for your time for being with us today. Well, you're welcome. We appreciate our right, association, Justin. Tom. Thank you very we much. We always have a good time, and uh, and uh, this is a great forum for us to get to those commercial hate treaters. Awesome. Good luck with everything in the future.